Greetings! Mantaray79 here! And welcome back to another deck profile video for the Card Fight Vanguard Trading Card Game. And now in today's video, the deck profile I'm gonna be making one for is a D standard formats. Dragon Empires, Relight the Star Virgila, DZBT02. Alrighty, let's get started. And now for the ride deck. For the cards in this ride deck, we have one grade zero, Virgila, starting unit. One grade one, Rising Star Virgila. One grade two, Shooting Star Virgila. One grade three, Relight the Star Virgila. And one, right deck crest, energy generator. The grade zero. Virgila, starting unit, skill, auto. When this unit is ruled upon, if you went second, draw a card. The grade one, rising star Virgila. Skills, first skill, continuous as a vanguard. During your turn, this unit gets plus 2000 power for each of your rear guards. Second skill, continuous as a vanguard. When you would ride from the ride deck, you can ride with Soul Blast 1 instead of choose a card from hand and discard it. The Grade 2 Shooting Star Virgila. Skills, first skill, action as a vanguard, once per turn. If you have four or more rear guards, cost, reveal a card with Virgila in its card name from the ride deck. If the cost is paid, this unit gets plus one critical until end of turn. Second skill, auto. When this unit is ruled upon, look at the top seven cards of your deck, choose up to one grade two card from among them, reveal it, put it into hand and shuffle your deck. If it was ruled upon by a grade three or greater card of Virgila in its card name, look at all the cards instead of seven. The grade three, relight the star Virgila. Skills, first skill, action as a vanguard, once per turn. Cost, energy blast three. If the cost and paint, choose one of your opponent's rear guards, bind it. Choose up to one grade two unit card from your drop and call it to rear guard. Second skill, auto as a vanguard. When this unit attacks, cost counterblast one. If the cost and paint, choose one of your grade two rear guards and stand it. The great, the right deck crest, energy generator. Skill, first skill, auto from the right deck. When you were right, Put this card into Crest Zone. If you went second, Energy Charge 3. Second skill, Continuous. You may have up to 10 energy. Third skill, Auto. At the beginning of your right phase, Energy Charge 3. Fourth skill, Action is once per turn. Cost, Energy Blast 7. If the cost and pay, draw a card. And of that, we just about covered the right deck. Next, let's get on to the Great One lineup. And now for the Great One lineup. For the Great Ones in this deck, we are playing four Great One Static Rat Dragon, three Great One Drag Ritter Mid Hot, three Great One Dancing Princess of Beautiful Flames Justina, three Great One Twin Buckler Dragon. And one, Great One, Blitz Order, Elementaria Sanditude. The Great One, Static Rat Dragon. Skill, Auto as a rear guard. When your other unit is placed on the rear guard in the same column as this unit during your turn, that placed unit gets plus 5,000 power until end of turn. The Great One, Drag Ritter Mid Hot. Skill, Auto as a rear guard. When your unit stand by a card's ability, cost, retire this unit. If the cost and pay, draw a card. The Great One. Dancing Princess of Beautiful Flames, Justina. Skill, auto. When this unit is placed on rear guard circle from hand, if you do not play in order this turn, cost, discard a card from hand. 
If the cost is paid, search your deck for up to one order card without regular piece, discard it, and it gets continuous. This card can be played from drop, and when it will be played, put it and put it into drop, put it into the bottom of the deck instead until end of turn, shuffle the deck. The Great One, Twin Buckler Dragon, Sentinel, Perfect Guard. Skills, first skill, Continuous Sentinel. You may only have up to four cards of Continuous Sentinel in the deck. Second skill, Auto. When this unit is put in the Guardian Circle, choose one of your units and it cannot be hit until end of battle. If your hand has two more cards, choose a card from hand and discard it. The Great One, Blitz Order, Elementary Sanitude. Skills, first skill, Continuous Sentinel. You may only have up to four cards of Continuous Sentinel in the deck. Second skill, Continuous. You may only have one Elementary Sanitude in the deck. Third skill, if your opponent's Vanguard has triple drive, this ability can be played without paying the cost. Plays of a cost of, discard a card from hand. If your Vanguard is grade three or less. If the cost is paid, choose one of your units and it cannot be hit until end of battle. Remove this card. So with that, we just about covered the deck's great one lineup. Next, let's get on to the deck's great two lineup. And now for the great two lineup. For the great twos in this deck, we are playing four, great two, Drag Ritter, Latifa. Four, great two, Blast Artillery Dragon, Brachial Force. Four, Great Two, Drag Ritter, Far Hat. And three, Great Two, Normal Order, Finishing Move, Stardust Blade. The Great Two, Drag Ritter Latifa. Skills, first skill, auto. When this card is placed on Rearguard Circle, other than by a unit's card's ability, if you play a normal order this turn, cost Soul Blast 1. If the cost is paid, look at the top 5 cards of your deck, choose up to 1 card with great less than or equal to your vanguards from among them, reveal it, call to rear guard if it is a unit card, and put it into hand if it is a normal order, shuffle your deck. Second skill, auto as a rear guard. When this unit attacks a grade 3 or greater unit, this unit gets plus 5,000 power until end of battle for each of your opponent's open rearguard circle in the same column as this unit. The Great Two, Blast Artillery Dragon, Brachial Force. Skill, auto as a rear guard. When this unit's attack hits, cost, retire this unit. If the cost is paid, draw a card, choose one of your opponent's rear guards and retire it. The Great Two, Drag Ritter, Far Hat. Skills, first skill, auto. When this card is put on the Guardian Circle from hand or discarded from hand while riding from the right deck, cost, Counter Blast 1 or Energy Blast 3. If the cost is paid, draw a card. Second skill, auto. When this unit is placed on the Rearguard Circle, if your Persona wrote this turn, cost, Counter Blast 1 or Energy Blast 3. If the cost is paid, choose a Great 1 card without Sentinel from your drop, call to the back row Rearguard Circle. The Great Two, Stardust Blade. Skill, play this with a cost of Counter Blast 1 if you have a Vanguard of Virgila in its card name. If the cost is paid, look at the top five cards of your deck, choose up to one unit card with great less than or equal to your Vanguard from among them, call to rear guard, shuffle your deck, choose one of your Vanguards and until end of turn, it gets auto as a Vanguard. When your rear guard is retired by the ability of your opponent's card, Search your deck for up to one normal unit, call to rearguard circle, and shuffle your deck. And continuous as a vanguard. This unit gets plus 3000 power for each normal unit on your rearguard circle and drop zone. And of that, we just about covered the deck's grade 2 lineup. Next, let's get on to the grade 3 lineup. And now for the grade 3 lineup. For the Great Threes in this deck, we are playing 3, Great 3, Relight the Star, Virgila. 2, Great 3, Force Ember Dragon, Red Exert Dragon. The Great 3, Relight the Star, Virgila. Since we already explained this card during the right deck portion of the video, let's skip ahead. 
the Great Three, Force Ember Dragon, Red Exert Dragon. Skills, first skill, continuous, as a rear guard or guardian. If your opponent's drive check or damage check revealed a trigger unit this turn, this unit gets plus 10,000 power and plus 10,000 shield. Second skill, auto as a rear guard. When this unit attacks a vanguard, cost, counter blast one. If the cost is paid, perform all of the following. First effect, choose one of your opponent's rear guards, retire it. If you do not retire a card, draw a card. Second effect, remove an over trigger from the drop zone. If the cost is paid, this unit gets plus 15,000 power until end of battle. And of that, we just about covered the deck's grade three lineup. Next, let's get on to the trigger lineup. And now for the trigger lineup. For the triggers in this deck, we are playing one, grade zero, dragon DD King of Resurgence, Drag Vita, over trigger. Four, grade zero, Burning Flail Dragon, Critical Trigger. Three, Grade Zero, Conduct Spark Dragon, Critical Trigger. Four, Grade Zero, Blaze Maiden Parama, Front Trigger. Two, Grade Zero, Stealth Fiend Amavira, Heal Trigger. And two, Grade Zero, Cure Flare Draco Kid, Heal Trigger. The Grade Zero, Dragon DD King of Resurgence, Drag Vita, Over Trigger. Skill, you may only have one Over Trigger in a deck. When revealed as a trigger, remove that card, draw a card, choose from your units, and it gets one plus 100 million power until end of turn. If revealed during Drive Check, activate its additional effect. Additional effect, choose one of your Vanguards and stand it. The Great Zero, Burning Flow Dragon, Critical Trigger. Skill, Auto as a Rear Guard. At the end of the battle, this unit boosted. Cost, put this unit into your soul. If the cost is paid, choose one of your units, and it gets plus 2,000 power until end of turn. The Great Zero, Blaze Maiden Parama, Front Trigger. Skill, Continuous as a Guardian. If your opponent's Vanguard is Grade 3 or greater, this unit gets plus 5,000 shield. The Great Zero, Stealth Fiend Amavira, Heal Trigger. Skill, Auto. When this unit is placed on the Guardian Circle, if your opponent's attacking unit has attacked two or more times this turn, this unit gets plus 15,000 shield until end of battle. Active if this battle is a second attack this turn or more. The Great Zero, Cure Flare Draco Kid. Skill, Auto. When this unit is put in the Guardian Circle, if the attacking unit's critical is two or greater, and the critical is increased by a ability other than trigger effect or its original critical is two or greater, this unit gets plus 15,000 shield until end of battle. And of that, we just about covered the deck's trigger lineup. For the triggers in this deck, we are playing one, Over Trigger, Drag Vita, seven, Critical Triggers, four, Front Triggers, and four, Heal Triggers. And with that, the deck's been built, card effects explained. Next, let's get on to explain the deck's main playstyle. So for the main playstyle of this deck, first you just ride from your right line normally from grade zero, one, two, and three. Then when it's time to set up your formation for the main playstyle of this deck, first you set up your back row. Ideally, in your left and or right columns, secure one or two static rat dragons. Then to call to your front row rear guards, you either call from hand or use the effect of Virgila or the order card starter split. It's a pure call great two cards from the drop zone. The great twos I advise you call are either Latifa and or Brachioforce. I advise Latifa because she is a secondary skill, which gives her a plus 5,000 power for every empty rear guard circle in the same column, or Brachial Force for whenever its attack lands a successful hit on the opponent, it can use its skill to retire your opponent's rear guard and let you draw more cards, pressuring your opponent to guard his attack to prevent you from taking advantage of its skill. And then, with, with either one you call, you can use Static Cat, Static Cat Dragon skill to empower the call unit with additional 5,000 power, giving it more power to make it easier to pressure your opponent. 
and in the other rear, front row rear circle, you can either call another grade two, maybe Latifa and or Brachioforce or the grade three Red Exert Dragon. And then you can also make use of the first effect of Virgila, which lets you bind a rear guard. I advise you, the, the rear guard you bind your opponent's field to be in the same column as Latifa. They will make it easier to use the power-up skill of your Latifa. And then the secondary effect of Stardust Blade, you can give your Vanguard plus 3,000 power for every rear, normal unit you have in your rear guard and drop zone, giving you a, a powerful Vanguard that your opponent will have a tough time stopping. Then when it's time to go to, go to the battle phase, always attack with a great two rear guard first. I preferably without the boost since thanks to Static Dragon skill, it'll give your van your great two rear guard plus 5,000 power, thereby making it a potential 15,000 point attacker at least, giving you a chance to save your boost for the second attack, which is after attacking the great two rear guard, attack your vanguard, use your second skill of Virgil to restand your great two rear guard, thereby giving you another attack to work with. And that's pretty much the main playstyle of this deck. First, you set up your formation using using the order card and the first skill of Vargila to superior call grade two rear guards, preferably Latifa and or Brachioforce. In your back row rear guard circles, in the left and or right columns, secure Static Rat Dragon. In your front row, use the grade two rear guards, Brachioforce, Latifa, or, and also maybe you can use plus your feel of the grade three Force, Force, em Force Ember Red Desert, Red Desert Dragon. Then use the first skill of of your Virgila to bind a rear guard circle in the same column as Latifa, making it easier to make use of her of her secondary ability, which powers up. And also use the secondary effect of your order card star display to make your Vanguard more powerful as well. Then attack your rear guard, Great Two rear guard first. Then attack your Vanguard. Use the skill to restand your Great Two rear guard, giving you four attacks in this turn. And as long as you set your formation right, it'll be easier to use all the skills available here in this field to pressure finish off your opponent. And of that, we just about covered the deck's great deck playing play style. And of that, that's just about the time we have for today. First, I want to say is thank you to the viewers for watching today's video and to please stay tuned for more videos I plan to upload again in the near future. I also be all sure support by liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing to my videos and channel. And of that, I say goodbye and see you all soon.